was, <laughs> it, it was just a tropical storm. Wow. And I say just a tropical storm, but the winds were about 65 miles per hour in the Keys down towards Miami. You can see the wind damage that it can do. It provided a lot of rain as well and some flooding from West Palm Beach all the way down to Key West and up towards Fort Myers and Naples. At this hour, it is still just a tropical storm. I say just because it is going over some very warm water. It is trying to get its act together. And you can see that convection, all these arrows and uh, areas in orange and red. It is trying to become more of a hurricane with the center of rotation. And it looks like it's going to possibly get that overnight tonight and by early tomorrow. The hurricane hunters are flying into this and taking measurements as of right now, though, just barely a tropical storm, just four more miles per hour and it becomes the hurricane. Uh, it looks like it's going to be making its track towards Biloxi or New Orleans by tomorrow night or early Wednesday morning. 86 degrees today, beautiful sunshine, a little bit of humidity this morning, but it dried out throughout the afternoon, almost 10 degrees above normal, nowhere near the record from 73. A little bit of a northerly breeze today between 15 and 21 miles per hour and a year ago, it was normal at 77. Weather headlines, a dry week ahead and because a lot of that moisture is going to be taken away uh, by Hurricane Isaac, but we may see a little bit of rain by the time we get to the end of the week. Friday night, Saturday, if the remnants of Isaac make their way all the way up into southern Wisconsin. 90s also return. We haven't seen 90 since August 7th and the pick day of the week tomorrow. So plan accordingly. If you have a sick day, give it a call. 64 degrees right now in West Bend, Port Washington and Sheboygan, 59 in Burlington and 69 degrees in Racine. The wind's pretty much calm. They will stay that way overnight tonight. Because of that and a little bit of moisture in the atmosphere, there'll be some patchy fog around the region. 58 for a low in West Bend, 58 in Burlington and 61 right here in Milwaukee. Tomorrow a little bit cooler. That's why it's the pick day of the week. Northeast, northeasterly wind at 5 to 10 will keep that lakefront in the mid to upper 70s. Waukesha westward. It'll be in the lower 80s. So the high pressure is going to dominate our weather for the next couple of days. Sunshine, low humidity, comfortable temperatures. But then the warm front moves in here, and we're going to get back close to 90 degrees by Thursday. If not then, uh, we could see it by Friday. Tonight, 61 degrees. Inland areas will be in the mid to upper 50s. A little bit of patchy fog. 78 tomorrow, a little bit warmer inland. Light northeasterly breeze and just a great looking day. Your seven-day forecast, 84 for Wednesday, near 90 on Thursday. If we don't see it on uh, Thursday, we'll hit it on Friday. And you notice no rain in the seven-day except for a slight chance Thursday night as the remnants of Isaac move just south of us. Weather kids back. That means it's back to school time. Oh Age my. three, Giovanni. Aww. 61, de uh, 61 degrees in the morning, but wearing the shorts for that afternoon. Beautiful. Look at that smile. Oh. School's back. Cute.